Hello everybody and welcome back to more Voidigo. We are jumping in again and this time of course we're going to play as the new character but we are going to go and open up this little room for him first and unlock his alternate starting weapon because apparently it's a lot better. It's a blunderbuss of some kind so I want to do that. Let's have a look and see in the locker. I don't know which one the blunderbuss is, I'll be honest. Um, it might be that one. <laughs> I honestly have no idea. But I've been told to get one of his alternate starting weapons. Let's just try this out. That's a shooting star. That isn't a blunderbuss. Whatever. We'll, we'll just take it on and give it a go. <laughs> Unless this isn't the character that they were talking about. I don't know. Whatever. It's fine. Let's just give this character a go and see what we can get done. Um, and have a good old time in this game once again. Let's start. We want to go as this guy here. Um, a scientist of many skills, he works tirelessly in his tower of problems, producing new and groundbreaking inventions. At night, you can hear uh, strange machinery and the sound of chalk on a blackboard as he theorizes his latest idea. We get the gym bot. After many years of lonesome hard work, it deci he decided that it was time to take on the ultimate challenge to create an artificial life. The result was a small levitating robot named Jimbot, created to assist in experiments far too dangerous to be handled by the living. Retrofitted with wireless connectivity, control systems, and an auto-return command. Whenever he moves fast, Jimbot will prove itself useful whenever you, um, wherever you are, even. Goddamn. I'll be honest, I'm not going to read all that. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, we have this thing here. And we get this. Whatever this shooting star is. And we'll, of course, go Rogue Difficulty again. And it's a new character. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. Let's give it a go. Um, this time. Oh, wait, what? Oh, dude. I see. My, um... My bot actually carries my gun. Intriguing. Intriguing indeed. Not what I expected. Not what I expected. Uh, I'm sure this will add some difficulty. Oh, God, yeah, this gun. I like this gun already. It's got some homing to it. It's got some AoE to it. I like that. Oh, also... The, the, an update came out uh, literally about an hour ago that did some quality of life stuff. And one of the things it mentioned was about um, adding in uh, more visibility to objects that can be broken for, like, items. And I can definitely see that already. Nice. I'm liking this gun. Gun's working mighty fine. We go over here. Another one of these bugs. I gotcha, I gotcha. Crack that open. Keep going. Oh, also? Yeah, this is now, now a new thing. That is incredible. Now they actually have this thing called the shortcut area. Where you can just shortcut between rooms whenever you want. Which genuinely is an absolutely fantastic change. Like, so, so nice to see. Kill this guy first, because he's going to get on my nerves. Did get hit there. Which one is it of you that hit me? It was you, wasn't it? The only thing about this gun is it's not the best one. There's a ton of enemies, because it's like... it. It's good that it hits them all, but you can't really aim for a specific enemy. Not great at that. We only got hit for a very small amount of damage there, though, so it's okay. We got ourselves the swordster. Oh, hello, the boss is here. Oh, dude, I can use melee at range. Dude, this is amazing. I can use melee at range. This is incredible. <laughs> I really like this. I really like this. Oh my god, this is so cool. Okay, that was a really bad hit there, I've got to be honest. <laughs> I absolutely love that. That's so cool. By the way, I, I, the reason that I was getting messed up in these before um, was because apparently if you fail the challenge, you get lowered to one hit away from death. So, good to know. This is an enemy's revive, right? Uh, I probably should go and buy that HP just in case. Dude, that's so goddamn cool. 
You, being able to use melee at range is awesome. It's a little hard to uh, finagle, though. Hey, I love that. So cool. <laughs> oh my god, this is like, I'm having so much fun right now. This is amazing. Um, stronger knockback, hit the jackpot, or dodging spikes. I'm going to go with the stronger knockback. That seems useful. And we've also got... Run the wrong way there, didn't I? Uh, fire bullets. I'll take fire bullets. I like the idea behind that. Right. I'm very happy right now. This this character is already looking to be one of my favorites. I'm really liking this. Right, through we go. Shortcut areas there. You see like these boxes have like a glow to them, you see that? And it means that there's stuff inside them. Really nice. You can say like so much safer. Absolutely love it. And then there's some durability there for us. Gonna be using melee weapons a lot as this guy, I think. Oh shit, we've got this guy. Um, Challenge the Void, definitely. That's just double bosses, which I can certainly deal with. I say certainly, like I know for sure. It's not certain at all. Let's try and kill the other stuff that's here first, shall we? Okay. You do lose a, little, lose a little bit of durability in the travel time of the melee weapon getting to them. Okay, got full durability on this thing again. I need to kill you. Get a nice one. Good, good. A bunch of these ants about. Not a big fan of that. Really need to focus down just the one boss, really. Good thing is I can kind of run around and do my own thing while my melee weapon just takes him on. It's got like a charge up there, you see that, where it can't be away from me for too long. Back here, bugs. You can stay out the range of the attacks. Like a yard buggering off now. We can grab that. Lovely. Um, and then we can... <gasps> Dude, I fuck... That's like one of the best changes they've ever made. Like, I had an issue with that, and they've basically entirely removed my main complaint with that. Dude, this is so cool. I'm loving this melee weapon right now. I got him. Durability's back again. Oh, dude. Bad hit there. It's okay, we've got health about. Seems that sprinting will always return him to me, so I've got to, like, not sprint, really. More durability there. I'd like that, please. Thank you. Keeping my durability going. Seems like we've got this guy in the bag. Awesome. A little bit more durability there. I guess I'll take the health, because why not? And my other boss is down there, so I want to go over here, into here. There you go. Oh, my God. That has improved the quality of life of this game tenfold. Oh, dude, that is a rough attack to dodge.
Dude. Okay. That's that's kind of a bummer. That's kind of a bummer. Um, that attack's really brutal. I'm not particularly sure how best to dodge that, I'll be honest. Not particularly sure how best to dodge that. Guess I've just got to be a little less committed to dealing damage. But that was still fun, though. And, like, we've not wasted that much time. Um, yes, please. 80 shards is an insane amount. Gimme, gimme, gimme. This is a good starter weapon for this guy as well. I like it. Okay, straight to the shop because we've got a ton of money to work with. Uh, what we got going on here. So we've got a melee weapon there. That's great. Faster movement speed's always good. Melee breaks wall seems useful as well. And then... That costs 15. We can't quite afford the one for 15 there. Right, back we go. I like the faster movement speed though. That's a real good start for me. Quickly go and grab that. <laughs> Jump on this guy's head. I'm really liking the like really crazy herming this thing gets. Kind of nuts. For you, you guys down here. I know you're a sniper, but not gonna have a problem with you. No problem whatsoever. The guys that shield up are the ones that are real issues. Oh, the triple stomp. You gotta love it. Beautiful. Keep moving. Would like a melee weapon soon. Nothing much in here. Goddamn, we are we are fast. We are speeding around. Okay, we've been here before, I see. I could just use the teleport thing. I need to, I'm going to have to get used to using the teleport thing, you know. I'm going to buy this melee weapon. Melee weapons just seem like the way to go as this character. Wait, is this not a melee weapon? I don't think it is. <laughs> Still, this thing's good. Um, ooh, what the hell? Gloppy, companion, ooh. Yes, I will do that, but I want to use my ammo first. Dude, this thing's kind of amazing. Maybe I'll try and get the boss kill before I do that, actually. Boss should be appearing, I think. Oh, we got all of these again. There you go, there's the boss. Yeah, this thing does good damage. Okay, we got our boot back again. Snacks on him. I like the little laugh this thing does as well. This little companion guy. Really bad idea to go point blank with him there. Don't know why I decided to do that. Right, we got him down. Oh, we got ourselves the banana gun. Dude, this thing just insta kills everything it touches. It's kind of crazy. I will take the banana over my starting gun. Thank you. Bit deaded. Good. I want to try and unlock the the, for, the next kill for this thing. Because uh, then I get my upgrade points for it. There you go. Did it. Why not get that first? Okay, keep moving. So now we can take the teleport zone here, and we can go... I, this is just amazing. Um, 
Do I want to go here? It was this room here, I think? I can't remember where it was now, actually. Oh, well, to be fair, we do want to go in here, definitely. These are all weapons, I think. Just do the skip challenge. Good. You do your thing and then I'll jump on your head. You dead? No. Now you are. Good, good. Crack that open. Instant upgrade bundle. Does that do much for us? What items do we have that can be upgraded? Do you know what? Yeah, that's that's pretty good, actually. We'll take the instant upgrade bundle. Um, 30% longer range, 50% stronger connection. I like that idea. That seems really good to me. Right, let's get out of here. Right, find this thing where we trade this weapon in, because I can't remember where it was now. Where's the thing that wanted our gun? I've lost you. I've completely and utterly lost you. <laughs> I'm so lost on where that thing was. There it is. I will do this now. Because I, I want whatever this little kid is. He looks kind of funky. Go to our shop real quick. Dude, what a, what a great addition to the game. I'm going to be gushing about that forever. Thank you. Right, let's kill the boss now. Now, this banana gun was kind of insane last time. Don't know why I took ammo there. That was kind of pointless, but I've done it now. The unfortunate thing is this banana does make some really kind of strange sounds. There you go. We got him down. Shouldn't be too long of a kill here. We should stomp on him for the boot attack. Oh, dude, this guy's getting destroyed right now. I really like this character, I've got to say. Really like this character. Right, bullet targeting Link. Um, I think that's good, right? I've had that before, I think that's good. Yeah, let's take that. We've got some health lying about here that we don't need to go for. And we're good to go to the next floor. Good, good. Us and our banana are on our little trip. Max HP is pretty risky right now. Nah, none of them are worth the trade. Trade power up for upgrade bundle. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that. The boots are good, but there's other stuff I could get that's better, I think. 60% um, longer, 100% stronger connection. I want to get this upgraded. And then what we got here. Shield on reload during battle sounds really good, but I want to keep my, um, whatever that power up is. Melee breaks walls. Actually, do you know what? No, I'm going to take the, I'm going to take the reload. Thank you. We'll be out of your hair now, game. We'll be out of your hair. I am liking where this is going. One second. Right, let's keep it moving. Yeah, I don't know what my little dude does, really. He seems to, like, poo out little bubbles every now and again. But, yeah. Decent enough. We've got more of these pointers here. I still don't really know what this is about. We're getting there with it, but I, yeah, I don't really know what it's for. Um, snake bullets. Extremely strong gravitational 
gravity that pulls you and projectiles to the ground. Okay, I can I can do that. Dude, can you... My body kept, like, buggering off. Okay, that was easy. More companion health. Ice bullets. Ooh, yes. I like the idea behind that. Open corrupted loophole. Yeah, I'll take that. It's a, it's a, it's a melee weapon. I wanted a melee weapon, so there you go. Right, let's keep it moving. Oh, can I break this? I can indeed. Beautiful. There's also a shack here. Ah, that's a weapon trade. We don't need that right now. We do have one of these things. I don't think I want to really feed that though right now. Good, got you. You sorry about this. I'm going to have to pause again. I've got a few messages coming through at the minute. But this thing's doing a really good job, this banana here. I'm liking it. Did you just jump over my projectile? Fuck you. No thanks. Ooh, I got my little reload thing there. Let's try out this melee weapon. Yeah, I like this. I like this thing a lot. Oh, we got another little cave here. Another challenge. Melee lasers. That sounds interesting. Do not dodge. That means don't jump, I think. If I remember correctly from last time. We got left. What we got left here? Um, What have we got left? I'm confused. Oh, there's like a mushroom guy hiding behind here, I see. Nice. Melee lasers. Don't know exactly how that works, but I like the sound of it. Health pickups also heal up companions. More companion health. Yeah, I'll take that. Cool. I will take that. One second. Right, let's keep moving. Uh, right, so I melee with like these lasers now. I'm intrigued by how that's going to go. Oh, we got a carriage. You only, you only need three. Do you know what? Yes, I'll take that. You only need three. That's not bad at all. Shop, what do you have in store for us today? One more link. I still don't really know how this link thing works. Um, Just an effortless navigation... He realized it could also be used to efficiently skull to skull bullet navigation. Doesn't really tell me much. Void attack during reload would also be nice. Faster sprint speed would also be good. We've got some good stuff here. Yeah. Keep moving. Go through here. All the birds again are out. Nice. Okay, I saw some lasers going off there. I like it. I like the lasers. Nice. That revived my companion as well. Hello, boss man. I'm liking all this extra range we're getting right now. The 30% there, good. But you are pretty much taken out now, good, good. Let's use our banana for now. Where you at? There you are. Oh, dude, stop moving. Every time. 
There you go, we got you, we got you. Another one of these little shacks. <gasps> Some ammo there. Uh, I'll take that as durability instead. I'd rather have melee durability right now. Where are we going next? Over here by the looks of it. There you go. Perfect. Oh, well, the, the navigation is just so much better now. Oh, dude, look at all those pots. Wow. Holy shit, I'm killing stuff without even realizing. Dude, oh, there was an enemy there. God damn it. I only got hit very, very lightly there, so it's okay. I actually might make health pickups appear a lot more often. Challenge void. I've got to do it. Every time, I've got to do it. What kind of man would I be? The fact that I can't heal right now does make this a little more scary, I guess, but... Hey, her. Not liking the fact that there's still a bunch of enemies about that I can't really do much about. Yeah. Things are getting a little hectic in here. Oh, dude, got hit. Fuck's sake. I might die again here. My hubris. Right. Move out of here. God, this is stressful. Okay, got that as well, nice. Oh, dude! That little fucker just dropped a bomb on me when he died. I wasn't expecting that. Right. Shop time, come back to you. The only thing I can buy to heal myself. We'll just take that for now, I guess. Oh, God. Stress, stress, stress. Um... Dude, this is perfect. Look at, look at that. How quickly I just went through the map there. Okay. Feeling way happier now. Good, good. Right. Boss. Wait, boss, where are you? One boss is over here. Let's take on this boss first. I don't know if the freezing does much to the bosses, but I'm hoping it does. Try our best here. I don't particularly know this boss very well, but let's see what we can do. Nah, the, the, the melee weapon's better. Oh, dude. You hit me hard there. Oh! I'm unfamiliar with this boss's attack patterns still. I'm unfamiliar with all the boss's attack patterns still, I'll be honest, but... That was close. Yes. Got you, good, good. Right, other boss. Where is other boss? Still moving around. Some health there. Pick that up real quick. You do your thing. You're not even in range to hit me, boy.
Make sure to give me ammo when I need it, please. There you go. Beautiful. What did I just say? Perfect timing. Don't know why you're firing over there, my guy, but I'll let you do you. I like this melee weapon as well. I, see, I feel like when you've got you're able to use a bit of range, all melee weapons just feel better. Right, now I've got to remember how this version works. Luckily, they have less health, so we should be okay to just deal with him. Yeah, we're doing really good damage here. As he moved again. See, this is another thing about this thing. Like, when they move... Is he going to keep moving? No? Yeah, I don't give a damn. I'll just follow him really quickly. Before, that was such a huge issue for me. Nowhere near as bad anymore. You going to do two rolls or three rolls? Just two rolls. Can you get closer so I can actually hit you, buddy? This moves a lot. I kind of forget that Mila destroys projectiles as well. Gym bot. Max upgrade, baby. Good. Cool, okay. We are, I think, good to go to the next floor now. I don't think there's anything else we want to do here. Just go. Right, uh, what's this? Oh, save and quit now. I don't need that. Um, trade weapon. That's kind of tempting. Claim your prize. Huzzah. Awesome. We got that HP, baby. Sacrifice power up for max HP. Hell yes. I, I only just got that. I don't particularly care about it. I'm not really using bullets much anyways. Sacrifice max HP for random bundles. There you go. Even trades, baby. We'll take the melee. And... I'll take the 20% faster respawn on that. Right, good, good. Okay. We are good to go. I'm really liking this new update, I've got to say. This is... Just my biggest complaint with the game, it's just completely alleviated. Elder, sufficiently experienced to control the room, but not wise enough to realize that. Dude, that void attack so cool. Got ourselves this thing, the Tri Blaster. Eh. Seems interesting, but like, not as cool as Big Banana Poop, but whatever you want to call this guy. Do I need to kill this thing? Yeah, I do. Okay. Okay. We got them all. I think we're all good. Nice one. We stomped on that bad boy. Shop here. Hello. Hello. Poison Sprinter in combat. 20% more. Oh, yeah, I definitely want that. I think that's so many upgrades, what the hell? It's only 15, I'll take that. I'll do the bullet ring on reload as well, why not? Take it all. Good. The gnomes are kind of tricky. Boss time. Oh, bloody hell, it's the horse again. Fuck me. Every single time I come against this horse, I have some troubles. So let's uh, try our best to stay alive, shall we? It just seems to be a boss that you have to dodge a lot more for than other bosses. 
Might just be a bit of placebo for me, not knowing the attacks. Okay, you're blocked out now, good. Challenge again. I think on this floor I'm going to skip the challenge just because I don't really know the bosses on this floor all that well. And I think that could end pretty badly for me. This is definitely by far my favourite character. Like, this character is so good. It allows melee weapons to be used way more safely and I love that. Nothing else to see here. Ah, shit. God damn. I want that ammo. Thank you. It like bopped it over towards me. Nice. The banana seems really good though. I'm liking this. You're just like that sort of AoE effect after it lands. Seems to do a good amount of damage. Void attack there. Crack that open, of course. Here's Horse Boy again. Take out the health we can while we're here. What's going on with my weapon right now? Oh, it's got no durability. I was like, why is it not firing? It's got no durability whatsoever. Which isn't ideal because I'm at the point now where I can actually fight this guy fully. I very much like to just be able to wail on him with my melee weapon, but we're not quite there yet, apparently. That void attack is so good. Music's getting crazy. It's okay, we got our melee weapon back again. Oh. We've almost got into second phase. I don't even know if we've had this boss in second phase before. There you go, that kills him off. Heals up my familiar. Rather nice. He's buggering off now. Right, let's check some of the other rooms here to try and get some more ammo, shall we? We really are running out. Trade weapon for upgrade bundle. Certainly tempting. Faster melee attack speed. Yes, please. Grounded. Don't dodge. I can do don't dodge. It means don't stomp on anyone either. I'm also worried about the ammo than anything. Ask and I shall receive. You're dead. Right, and then this. I've never bought one of these before, but I will get a full refill on that. We get that as well for our fast melee swings, which should be amazing. And then we've got instant recharge, instant max HP, blocking bullets. Instant max HP, I think, is best there. Beautiful. Get out of here. Keep doing some of these other rooms real quick. Hey, we got more of these again. Some enemies will respawn as void enemies. Hmm. Yeah, let's take that. Yeah, not quite sure what void enemies do, but I'm going to guess that they're a lot harder. Damn it. 
Bit of a bad hit there, but it's okay. Okay, Uh, what the fuck hit me then? Oh, this void enemy, I see. I didn't see him there. Oh, so the respawn is random void enemies. I thought the respawn is void enemies of themselves. Like, a voided version of themselves, not just a random enemy. That's why I was getting a bit confused. Everything dead? No? Oh, I've got some gnomes, I see. Okay, all good. So, I want this. Like, how do I take my banana split back through with me? Like, can I can I come back to this room? I think I can, right? Let me let me leave and see. Yeah, okay, that that comes back through with me, good. So let me take this banana split back through here. No, that was the wrong goddamn weapon. It says banana split right there. I thought it was... Oh, for God's sake. I'm so annoyed about that. Very annoyed about that. That is not what I meant to do at all. I wanted to have two melee weapons, but... Hey, her. I think I just saw it slightly wrong. Take out those two. Right, let's take a look at where the boss actually is now. Right, hopefully this melee weapon's better than the one I just threw away by accident. Bit annoyed about that. This guy's in a really terrible spot for me to fight him right now. If he could, like, move away from where he was. I'm gonna wait if he just finish off this attack. There you go. Okay, this, this, this melee weapon feels good. Feels real good, actually. <laughs> good, good. Probably think more like HP, longer attack time, longer duration. Nah, I'm gonna go with the Void thing, because that's really good. Ah, and it's a level up as well, nice. Bullets knock back enemies. Close to sharp turn. Stomp full stake buttons appear. I'll take that. Right, next floor. It's all been a bit stressful, this, but we're getting there. Nah. Sacrifice power up for max HP. Nah. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take any of those. I'm pretty happy with how things are going right now. This is the last floor, I think, as well. Literally the biggest limiting factor is gonna be our ammo. I wish I had two melee weapons to go into this with, but hey ho. The ground separates you and the puppeteer. A thin film impenetrable. Some rules can't be broken. That's a void enemy there, right? Wait, what was it asking me to trade? Oh, yeah, I can do that. Let me kill this goober first. Yes. Oh, this isn't this isn't a gun either. This, this isn't a melee weapon either, sorry. This is apparently a gun as well. Okay. Just ignore most things for now. Get our segments unlocked. I see you, boss. I don't care about you. Oh, no, I do care about you for a minute. But I've got to do this to get out. It's okay. 
Things are looking a bit menacing right now, but we're dealing with it. It's fine. We're dealing with it. It's fine. Okay, there should be all of them squared away now. I can't remember what I've got to attack to deal damage here, but I'm trying my best. The good thing is with the lasers here, it's going to be hitting a lot of the other uh, bosses as well. More ammo there. We need a lot more ammo than this. And the situation is not great. We don't need Horsey Boy to get out of here. He's causing the most issues by far. Ow, ow. Oh, I just got double hit. Come on now. More ammo. Okay, first phase done. What do I do with this? I stomp on it, okay. Very confused for a hot minute there. I don't remember how this works. I don't really know how good this weapon is, but based on the fact that it only has 30 ammo, I'd expect it to be pretty darn good. This fucking fight is so intense, I love it. It's like way too much, but also just the right amount. I feel like I've used a lot of ammo on this thing, I've not done much. Whoa, what the hell? They hit me so many times. I just want the ammo that's over there. Bugger off. This weapon seems terrible. <laughs> Thus far. It's really hard to tell because it might be doing a lot of damage and I'm just not really able to tell. But it's got a really long reload. It doesn't seem to fire very often. And it seems to be doing not really that great a damage. I need more ammo though, boss. Like, at the minute, I'm having a real ta hard time with my ammo. There's some ammo in the middle there. Forgot about this attack. Nice one, we did it, baby. We did it. Oh, beautiful. So now we can either loop back to the start or end the run. I will do looping at some point, but once I get quicker at the game. Once I get a bit faster in my runs, but still, that was a really fun run. Uh, end your run, yes. Really fun run. Getting used to the game now. I'm going to be playing that character quite a bit more. <laughs> I'll be honest. This is going to be my main character from now on. I think it makes the game more fun because you can use melee weapons so much more aggressively. And I like that a lot. Back to camp. Oh, let's skip through all of these. So we've got um, 7 out of thingy, 2 out of 5, 9 out of 12, 14 out of 50. Okay. 
Right, so first thing I want to do is I want to actually go in here and unlock a starting weapon for this guy that's a melee weapon. Which I'm assuming this is. I'm going to be really annoyed if it's not. Yeah, that's got to be. Cool. Don't want to go for that. And then we'll open up some new areas as well. Hello. Twelve to open this one. Let's go for it. I'm guessing this is another new character, right? Yeah, it is. Cool. Doctor Fusion. A radical surfer who rolled the waves of science as he delved too far into the tubular realm We've got eight of eight left at the minute. We'll leave the eight, and you guys can suggest some stuff to spend it on. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. I have enjoyed it thoroughly. It's been a lot, a lot of fun. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.